What if someone called me out wearing top to the bottom? Nobody cares. <laughs> Nobody cares about my life that much. But that in the video. <laughs> Collect Plus, and uh, oh, my supplies have arrived. I bought my materials online from Jackson's Art Supplies. They offer a click and collect to my local Collect Plus store. This is really useful for me on days when I can't wait for delivery. So what you're going to need for book binding is two types of paper, the cover pages and the insides, PVA glue. You're also going to need strong bulldog clips, a muslin cloth or a cheese cloth, a book tape, which is also very easily obtainable from eBay or Amazon, and a cutting mat, a rough bristled brush for your PVA glue, a metal ruler for precision, exacto knife, a pen or pencil, and a pair of scissors. So the first thing you want to do is measure out your paper and this really depends on how big you want your sketchbook or notebook to be. So I'm going to measure out half of an A4 which is an A5, mark it down with your pencil and then cut it with your X-Acto knife. So you want to cut the inside pages as well, the same size as your cover. The thicker the paper, you're going to want fewer pages just because the glue won't hold if you have too many. So use your cutting mat or any flat surface at home to even out the pages to one, one edge. You're going to use your bulldog clips to clamp the pages, not very close to the edge, so that you have space to work in. Then you're going to squeeze out some PVA glue onto a dish, and using your brush, you're going to brush on some glue onto the, onto the flat side, a very, very thin layer so that the pages aren't wet. And then we're gonna leave it down for about two minutes or until the PVA glue goes transparent. Okay, it's been two minutes. You roll out the muslin cloth and then you put the sticky edge down and using your scissors or X-Acto knife, just cut away the sides. It doesn't need to be very neat because we're gonna cover it up later anyway, but you want all the cheesecloth to be touching the pages on the flat side and then using your book tape measure out the length of the book we're going to stick it on one side about half an inch in and then going to wrap around very tightly around the spine and onto the next side once i have a few books ready i can use collect plus to send them out as gifts it's really easy to do i just buy a label online and then i can send them from the same store i picked up the supplies 